Hey Android developers, I'm Joe Fernandez of the Android Developer Relations team. Today I'll explain how to record a video of your Android app using the new screen record feature of Android KitKat. To use this feature, you'll need a device running Android KitKat, like the Nexus 5, and a micro USB cable. No video or camera required. So why record a video of your Android app? Good question. A video is an effective way to demonstrate your app and it gives users a quick way to see how your app works and what it can do before they download it. So it's a great promotional tool. Creating a video that explains how to use advanced features or correct common mistakes is also a great use of app videos. Is there a question about your application you get asked over and over? Record a video to show your users how it's done. So what do you need to use the screen record feature? Well, you need a device using running Android KitKat, such as the Nexus 5. You also need a computer with the Android Debug Bridge installed. If you have an Android uh, software development kit installed on your machine, then you already have ADB. Finally, you'll need a micro USB cable to connect the computer to your device. As I mentioned, you don't need a video camera to use screen record. However, this feature does not record audio. So if you want to narrate your video, you need to use something to record your voice as you demo. I recommend using a second Android device with an app that does high definition voice recording. Here are the steps to record a video. First, connect your USB cable from your computer to your device. Then make sure it's working by running a test command such as uh, ADB devices. Type the screen record command to start recording and then perform your demo on the device. If you're doing narration of your demo, don't forget to turn on your voice recorder. When you're done with your demo, press the Control C to end the recording. Finally, download the recorded video to your computer using the pull command. Here's a video I recorded using the screen record feature. It shows a quick walkthrough of the Android KitKat user interface. I recorded this video using only commands I just showed you. Notice that there are no hands or fingers in this video. This is a direct recording of the screen activity, including the animations and user actions. The moving circle is a touch indicator. I'll explain how to turn on that indicator later in this video. Here's some pro tips for producing a great app video. Write a rough script of the, or outline of what you want to demo. The script doesn't have to be elaborate, just listing a few key steps will help you create a complete video more quickly. Practice the demo a couple of times before recording it. Practicing will improve the quality of your presentation and help you discover parts of your demo where you can improve your flow. Pay attention to the speed of your on-screen actions. If your explanation is lagging behind your on-screen gestures, slow down and try pausing between actions. Use the developer settings to show touches. This option displays that moving circle you saw in my demo video. Turn this feature on in the settings app. It's in the developer options page under the input heading. Record while you demonstrate your app. Adding, this makes adding narration to your video a lot easier. Also, remember to start recording video before you start audio recording. That makes it easier to fit your audio to your video during editing. Finally, use a separate microphone for recording your voice. Built-in microphones work, but you'll typically get better audio quality with a separate microphone that's held close to your mouth. YouTube is a great way to distribute your video. You can use YouTube Video Editor to do some basic editing, including adding a music track, which can make your promotional videos a lot more engaging. If you're adding narration to your video, you'll need to use a video editor application to add your voice audio track to your video before you upload it to YouTube. On Windows, check out uh, Movie Maker for this purpose. On Apple, iMovie, and on Linux, try Kden Live. For more details of the screen record feature of KitKat, check out this link. Have a great time uh, making those app videos. I'm Joe Fernandez, and thanks for watching.